Spokane Sheriff's deputy who shot a suicidal man earlier this month may have also saved the suspect's life. Sergeant Bill Beeman and his fellow deputies were carrying a new first aid product that stops severe bleeding. KXY 4's Jeff Humphrey joins us live at the Sheriff's Office with a look at the new survival gear. Jeff? Well, Dave, once deputies leave this parking lot, they are very much on their own, often pulling patrol duties in very remote parts of Spokane County. And that's why the deputies recently began carrying this quick clot sponge. They can use it if they're shot or stabbed to actually control their own bleeding until their backup arrives. Or in the case of this shooting earlier this month, use these sponges to save someone else. 911, what are you reporting? I am reporting a man that appears to be trying to commit suicide on the Damas Spokane Road. It was already dark by the time sheriff's deputies had heard about Michael Marley's bizarre behavior. He has a white Chevy pickup with a rag that is in the gas tank that is on fire. When Sergeant Bill Beeman first spotted Marley, the man allegedly charged the deputy with a knife. They were confronted by the apparent driver of that vehicle. and he presented a threat to one of our officers and shots were fired. Marley was hit by two 45 caliber slugs in his stomach. That's when the sergeant holstered his pistol and pulled out his brand new first aid kit. On the top of the pouch you have a cinch tight dressing, the one handed dressing, and then there's four packages of the material in here. Inside each package there's a sponge, really just a mesh bag filled with an absorbent material that soaks up the water in your blood, leaving behind the cells and hemoglobin that can form a clot. This one-handed cinch dressing holds the sponge in place even if the deputy is doctoring himself. They can use this product to basically save their life and either evacuate from that situation or continue the fight now that they've stopped the bleeding. But in Marley's case, the fight was over and deputies used their quick clot to keep the suicidal man alive until paramedics arrived. They had the product with them. Uh, when they rolled him over and moved him, they saw that he, uh, he was bleeding uh, severely and they used their training and the, uh, the product to stop that bleeding. Now the active ingredient in click quick clot is very similar to the insulation that's used in the space shuttle. In fact, a man who was working on the space shuttle cut himself and then made that connection. Since that time, it's been used successfully for our soldiers in Iraq and Afghanistan. And in the near future, quick clot is going to be available in department stores for those accident prone hunters and hikers. Reporting live at the Sheriff's Office, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.